Hi, welcome back to Rebecca's Travels. So if you're watching my lifestyle channel, welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle. Hi, how are you all doing? I hope everybody is um, as well as possible. And um, for the last two days, um, in the UK, the weather has been sunny and um, has been a, a generally um, quite warm and hot uh, but not too hot ni uh, basically nice temperatures I would say um, and so and um, if you're new here to my channel hi my name's Rebecca I love talking about travel and lifestyle please hit the subscribe button don't forget to click the notification bell so you never miss an upload and um, I would love to have more subscribers to add to my squad and a big thumbs up for doing so and a big thank you very much i really appreciate it and um, today i'm going to be doing a uh, top 10 best all-inclusive holidays at uh, part one august 2023 uh, this um is according to um for six of the facts and um, ice at lolly.com and um, with all inclusive holidays you get um at three meals a day return flights accommodation plus drinks and snacks and um, the difference between full board and um all inclusive is full board is just three meals a day um, with um, your return flights and accommodation um, but all inclusive um, you get an um, extra such as um, your drinks and snacks as well as three meals a day um, including um, so um, number one um, most popular um, all inclusive um, at places um, is you can find a lot of all inclusive um, hotels and resorts um, in Mallorca which is the largest of the Balearic Islands in the Mediterranean and uh, ranked among the best destinations for cheap all inclusive holidays um, I've uh, been to Mallorca I've uh, stayed in the uh, Marty Ho Hotel but it's a complex resort Marty uh, Jupiter and Santo complex and um, again it's an absolute brilliant uh, resort um, again absolutely lots to do um, but um, there's lots of other um, hotels um, in Mallorca uh, and the Balearic Islands in general that offer all inclusive options um the marty marty santo and the jupiter complex was based in the resort alcudia but there are other resorts um that offer all inclusive packages number two is another country that i've been to and um i I went to the Playa das Americas Resort and at Tenerife. Um, it's a Canary Island. Um, it's fair for a field than Mallorca, but no less popular with Brits. There's really uh, something for everyone in Tenerife, and I d again, I agree with that. Um, absolutely lots to do in Playa das America Resorts. Um, and um, I went all inclusive there, really enjoyed it. Um, with um, all the leisure facilities and at entertainment um, available. 
and uh, number three um, is another resort uh, that um, originally um, I was going uh, um, I was going half board but then I was um, upgraded uh, to all inclusive by Air Tours at the time and um, it uh, was um, the four star Mirage Hotel that was just being built so not all the facilities were available so they upgraded us to all inclusive option which was absolutely fantastic um, and again that was uh, just up the road from Benadorm Palace um, which is a fantastic theatre um, and again Benadorm uh, coming in at number three Costa Blanca is a staple destination for years among British tourists and it's easy to see um, how it maintains its proper popularity not only with the the, um, the Benidorm uh, TV show um, which um, my brother actually stayed in the same four star hotel and uh, with his mates and really enjoyed really enjoyed it um, that, but again a lot of um, again all inclusive options um, in Benidorm and uh, number four um, is another um, country that I've been to at Lanzarote. I, um, as a family, we went self-catering on that holiday. Um, Lanzarote offered everything um, for perfect sun uh, summer or winter escape, um, the same as Tenerife, uh, because uh, you get um, good weather like all year round. Um, and it's great for summer or winter destination um, and again a lot of all-inclusive options with hotels uh, there even though we, uh, we went south catering um, number five at uh, the Algarve um, we as a family went to uh, south catering and um, it's famous for its uh, fantastic uh, fish restaurants, uh, which they are abs uh, absolutely amazing. Hot spicy uh, pear pear chicken, lively bars, unspoiled beaches. It's hard to find why Algarve uh, remains, or it's hard to see why the Algarve remains a fir firm favourite. Um, with Brits year after year again there's a lot of self catering in the Algarve but um, there's also a lot of um, all inclusive options and um, hotel based as well um, now um, according to tui.co.uk slash all inclusive um, number six um, if you want to not travel to Europe but travel worldwide further afield then Mexico does a lot of all-inclusive options and um, coming in at number seven is Greece um, I've been to um, but I would we as a family was um, staying um, either half board or self catering i've been to um a corfu second thos uh, roads um at crete um and uh, yes uh, there's um, again a lot of all inclusive options and um, increase and um, as well as other accommodations such as uh, self catering um, and um, half board bed and breakfast but you can get a lot of holidays um, in Greece as all inclusive now um, again those that want to travel further afield um, www.visitsaudi.com um, slash vacation 
um, coming in at number eight um, is a, again a, a relatively new country that's opened up to the, um, the tourist world um, which is called Saudi Arabia offers um, all inclusive options also according to www.traveleditions.co.uk number nine um, UK escorted tour packages um, so you can get all inclusive es escorted tour packages and at uh, number 10 um, again um, Europe tour packages um, as well are um, according to traveleditions.co.uk they do Europe tour packages uh, they are one of the UK's leading specialist independent tour operators and again offer packages uh, that are all inclusive um, that um, even your tours are um, all included in the uh, price um, which you pay as as well as um, meals and um, so that's um, again another option out there that you uh, can go for and um, I would love to do another vi uh, video um, on this because there's uh, lots more um, all-inclusive options uh, worldwide so i would love to do a part two on this i would like to say thank you for watching and i'll see you on sunday with travel news sorry i'll see you on sunday with my travel and my lifestyle channels improvements updates and more i hope you have um, a fantastic weekend and i'll see you on sunday and um, i would like to say thank you for watching and bye for now thank you bye